hate to do it, but I was talking about the combine and about a kicker putting it up 25 times. And, you know, I can't help it. When I see David Beeler, a kicker, do that, it makes me think of Jim Guy. I'm not saying he's Jim Guy. I'm just saying it makes me think of Jim Guy. You know, golf guy. You know, likes to fight guy. You know, at the party guy. And you know Jim Guy. We all know him. We all hate him. You don't need to spend a lot of time in gyms to even know the guy I'm talking about. You know, the guy who rocks the weightlifting gloves. The gloves that he has to re-Velcro before every big set. Unless he's a true purist and he goes with just chalk. The same guy who grabs a complete stranger and says, yo, bro, can I get a quick spot? Only to freak out if you try to spot him or assist him in any way, screaming, I got it, I got it, don't help me. The same guy who, when you're in the middle of a couple sets, says, is it cool if I work in? Even though he knows it's not cool. He knows it's not cool. He just doesn't care. It's never cool to work in. Working in, by definition, is uncool. It's an imposition. It's rude. He knows it's not cool. I don't know why he asks, but he does it anyway. And then he sweats up your machine. And if you tell the guy, no, I'd rather you not do that. I've got a couple of sets left. He just sets up shop five feet away and stares at you until you're done, muttering under his breath about how jacked up your form is. And the second you are done, He stomps over to the machine and adjusts the weight as quickly as possible to make sure you and everybody else knows how much stronger he is than you. Jim Guy grunts like he's trying to pass a kidney stone. Jim Guy loudly drops dumbbells on the floor after his dumbbell press so everyone knows he's the guy using 120 pounders. The only guy. Jim Guy also loads his 60 megabyte iPod with Godsmack. Yeah. Time to get a lift. Bench press. Chest day. Yeah. Because Godsmack's got to be the chest pet playlist. And there are different playlists the Pex playlist, the Delt playlist. The Delt playlist is Megadeth, usually. And trust me, they all rock. Every playlist hard. And the fact is, Jim Guy's not there to work out. Jim Guy is there to work. It's a job to him. In fact, he doesn't even call it working out. To him, it's training. Oh, and Jim Guy double fists his beverage. You know that. A gallon-sized jug of water and a bottle of CarboForce energy drink that he sips between sets. And that's just to get him through the workout or the training. Because when he's done, he takes off in a dead sprint to the nutrition bar and he loads up on muscle milk and whey protein shakes with a shot of creatine because... You don't make your muscles wait for protein. There is a 40-minute window for protein. You don't make your muscles wait. Dude's got a tab at that nutrition bar, as you probably know. Yeah, I don't even blame the guy, though, for loading up his iPod with Godsmack and Megadeth. I mean, what's the alternative? Trying to lift to top 40 pop schlock that every single gym already has in heavy rotation. It's like, I'm trying to get fired up to get in shape. Can you spare me the Matchbox 20? Coldplay is not getting me fired up for my lift. Gym guy. And good luck if gym guy ever steps in and gives you a spot. You know, it's your own fault if you ask for one. But the fact is, no matter how many reps you've already done, No matter how gassed you are, depleted you are, Jim Guy always thinks that you have one more in you. Forget that he basically deadlifted the last three reps for you. Now now you're working. And now you're about to have your larynx crushed 
by the bar because he thinks that you've got one more left. A guy you don't know that you've never worked out with who just stepped in to give you a spot because he knows your body. He knows what you can do better than you know what you can do. Your arms are jelly. He's pulling it up for you, screaming at you, and you're going to get your trachea or larynx crushed. He's doing all the work. He's pulling it up for you, but he's screaming, it's all you. It's all you. Really, freak? It's none of it's me. None of it's me, and none of the last five reps have been me. Get away from me. I'm done. No, I'm done. No, I'm dead. No, you're not, punk. Give me one more. Screw you, Jim Guy. One more, punk. Lock your arms. Lock it out. Lock it out. It doesn't count unless you lock it. Do it, punk. Now you're just crying. Now you're crying. Leave me alone. Lorenzo Romar joins me when we come back. Dear Jim, let me tell you one time where it's okay to work in. When the loser using the machine or equipment is long rest who likes to talk to everyone in the gym guy. Screw him. Sometimes I don't even ask. I'm working in. Kyle and SD.